Hello there, welcome to Blink and Beep. Thanks a lot for choosing to watch this video. In this video, I will show you the steps to connect and uh, pair your Tapo camera to the Tapo mobile app. Let's start by installing the TP-Link Tapo app from Play Store. Click open. The first thing we see is a dialog box where we accept the terms and conditions. Next thing, for first time use, we have to sign up for the TP-Link ID. It is pretty simple. Just a valid mail id and password. Now since I already have a tp-link id, I will continue with the login. Once you log in, the home screen of the app will be empty with a plus icon and it says tap to add your device. Click on it. For this demo, I will use my Tapo C200 camera. I am pretty sure the steps are the same for all the other camera models shown here. So you can keep continuing even if you have a different model. As instructed here, ensure that your camera is connected to power and wait for about 30 seconds until the LED blinks uh, red and green. Here is a footage from my actual camera, so until you see the red and green LEDs blinking, you have to wait. Once you see that, click on next, enable location access on the mobile. And click on next again. And here is the important step. You should see the Wi-Fi of your Tapo cam in the dialog box. Click on connect and wait for a few seconds. If you don't see the Tapo's Wi-Fi connection and instead if you get a message like this, please follow the below steps. Click cancel, go to your mobile's Wi-Fi settings. Click on the Wi-Fi connection that starts with the name Tapo Cam. Wait until you see the uh, connected no internet text. Now click on back and that's it. So you should see this animation representing that the Tapo Cam is identified and uh, ready to be paired with the mobile app. It takes you to the next screen where you will have to select the Wi-Fi network um, to which the Tapo Cam is to be connected at all the times. So only 2.4 GHz channel is supported. Uh, provide the password and click on next. Again verify your password and click on next. You should see the message connecting to your network at the bottom of the screen. So here it gets connected and your Tapo cam gets paired to your mobile but in my case it didn't happen. As we see in this screen. I am instructed to connect to the Wi-Fi network manually and return back to the app. So let me try that. I am changing my network from Tapo's Wi-Fi to my home Wi-Fi. Clicking on back. Now we see the message as pairing your Tapo device in the bottom of the screen. Yep, I think it is paired. So provide a name you like. Or click on next if the default name is still good for you. Set a location for the camera from the list of places. I will just choose home, configuring and complete. Finally, sounds good. Choose a convenient time for firmware upgrades. 3 am to 5 am seems to be perfect to me. Clicking on got it. I hope you have the SD card inserted already. If not, do so. I already have mine. So clicking on got it. Again got it. And here we go. The Tapo cam is finally configured and paired. If you are interested about the other features of this Tapo app, I have a complete video on it already and the link should be on the screen and in the description of this video. Check it out. And uh, that's it for this video. Catch you another one. Thank you. Bye bye.